According to head coach Petros Kiprianu, Georgia track and field has a pair of silent killers and twin sisters Jessica and Samantha Drop. The sisters burst on the scene during their freshman year and have been top competitors in their events ever since. For Jessica, who is competing in the 5,000 meters in the qualifying prelims this weekend, the path to becoming an elite distance runner was much different than her sister. I hated running when I started my freshman year of high school because I only did it, I was only going to do indoor track to stay in shape for soccer. And like I knew I was fast, but I didn't know I was like that fast. And then it was by the end of my sophomore year when I started realizing how good I was and it was kind of getting more fun as I started winning more. So just a little bit different grind to be a three season running athlete versus you know having soccer on a high school level and then transition into track but she's done it all very well. For Jessica her sister Samantha played a major role in her progression as a runner. Having always been a distance runner Samantha has taught Jessica how to handle the longer distance races better. She had always done cross country ever since middle school so she she knows how to run. She knows how to run a race smart. I know how to run a race strong and I've kind of learned throughout like the last definitely since I've been in college how to pace myself in a race. Even with different strengths there's definitely sibling rivalry. When she's coming back like when she's in front of me and she beats me she knows I'll be like sprinting as hard as I can to <laughs> try to catch her. The push from her sister and coaches has placed Jessica in the record books at Georgia as she holds the women's 5,000 meter outdoor record. Jessica has also earned honors as a 2017 and 2018 NCAA cross country all region runner a 2017 NCAA cross-country All-American runner, a 2018 NCAA first-team indoor All-American in the 5,000 meters, and a 2018 NCAA first-team outdoor All-American in the 5,000 meters. Shows up and, and, and runs the 5K very fast, and uh, she has run so many races under 60 minutes, uh, which is a, it's an elite status. And helping her team win a national title last year, I mean, she was the icing on the cake. Uh, gave Actually, I've never seen anybody actually giving literally 110%, and she did. Heading into the 2019 outdoor season, Jessica had a new respect for her ability to run after dealing with some mental and physical struggles earlier in the year. This year has been one of my more difficult years. I had some mental issues in the fall, just having low energy, I guess. And then in the winter, I actually got injured. I tore a ligament over my knee. So I, outdoor was the first season I felt like myself and I was like getting in the groove. So I'm kind of excited for the rest of the season and see what, what else there is to come. I think it turned into an incredible blessing. And now she goes into outdoor track a lot fresher. Unlike I have been running, and I should be able to qualify. So I think that's it. Just be confident with my training and not really do anything, anything differently, but just go in with the mindset that I have a very high chance of qualifying. Despite great success at the University of Georgia and helping her team to a national title, Jessica still has big goals she hopes to achieve before she graduates. Um, one of the, I think one of the big ones is to get an SEC um, championship title because I think it's an obtainable goal and I've been very close many times so that's one I'm definitely working towards.